the What's perception of me. Right. And I believe the perception of how men approach but me. But you must believe it if you think people are thinking it's do about Do I think you. I'm attractive? Yeah. Yes, I do. Samantha Brick became infamous in the UK after declaring that she is so beautiful and that is why women hate her. Well, karma is a because now she's got an acne problem. Sounds like voodoo to me. My name's Michael McCrudden talking about a woman with a terrible acne condition here for you on IO. Before we jump into that, I gotta ask you guys, have you picked up your IO t-shirt yet? Well, have ya? You can get free shipping on any order containing a male or female tank top through the dates July 15th to the 22nd. To get this deal, use the coupon code Tank you. It's one word, it's right here in front of me. You use that, free shipping for you. And an IO t-shirt. Once you have that t-shirt, send a photo to me of you wearing it and we'll be sure to post it in IO response. How does that sound? It sounds like a lot of fun. Let's get back to the story. Samantha Brick. She is a formal viral sensation. In 2012, Brick published an article titled, There is a downside to looking this pretty. Why women hate me for being beautiful. Her arrogance in the article caused the whole thing to go viral on social media and websites and it became a global trending topic on Twitter. The article got 1.5 million hits on one newspaper website and nearly 5,000 readers left comments. Most of them were far from pleasant. No one likes a mean comment, guys. Go easy on us. Like I said in the intro, I think someone cast a voodoo spell on Samantha Bricks because now she's going through an acne epidemic. Now it's tough to crack jokes about acne, it sucks, everyone gets them and it's never a good time in your life when you got a whole bunch of gunk on your face. Well Samantha has been on medication to keep her acne from breaking out but now she's trying to have a baby with her hubby. She went off the meds and that's what caused this acne to break out. She's tried a lot of things, she said herself. She hasn't found a solution just yet, but I am hoping that voodoo spell gets lifted and she goes on to live a happy life. Not an arrogant one, just a regular old acne free happy one. So just quickly, if you guys hate pimples, hit that like button down below. I want to see how many of you out there actually hate them. For more information on this story, be sure to check out the links down below. My name's Michael McCrudden. I'm having an acne free day. I hope you guys are all too.